Hello and welcome to another Docklands News weekly update. My name is Sean Rogash and we're out here on Harbour Esplanade and you can probably tell from what's behind me why we're out here. It's a wonderful sand sculpting exhibition. There's five great sculpt sculptures down here. 20 tonnes of sand were brought down to Docklands for the exhibition and it feels like a beach all of a sudden down here and there's the match you'll probably notice flying around me. To add to the beach feel this weekend, there's also a great chance to bring your fishing rod down and catch a fish or two. There'll be a local angling club down here to help you out with some great tips on how to catch fish in Victoria. Hopefully, like these blokes behind me here, you'll be catching fish and eating a lovely snapper or something like that for dinner on Saturday night. On Sunday, make sure you get down to the WTC Wharf because the Chinese New Year Dragon Boat Regatta will be on down there. And it's a great day of hard racing in the Dragon Boats. It's a great spectator a sport because you get to see the whole track on the water there from a, a real nice view down at uh, WTC Wharf and you might even slip into the uh, Wharf Hotel for a drink or two afterwards. Starts at 8.30 in the morning so make sure you get down early and there will be plenty of Docklands local teams racing as well. Plus I'll be down there with a the camera so you might end up in the Docklands news if you're not careful so no excuses not to get down there on Sunday. Only today some great news for people in showbiz, producer Beth and I, because the Docklands studios are in the middle of a $10 million upgrade and the Minister for Innovation Services and Small Business, Louise Asher, has opened last week the uh, a Stage 5 of that upgrade, Stage 5 and a workshop down there at the Docklands Studios. So it's all coming along really well and Minister Asher has really committed to bringing down uh, great projects and world-class facilities here in Docklands for for uh, recording studios and, and uh, productions and the like. So it's a great little initiative by the government and it helps Docklands, of course, as well. That's it for us this week. We'll see you next week on Friday. Don't forget, Docklands is beautiful.